Happy Pumpkin Day greetings. Welcome to the show and share video of my pumpkin Halloween collection, including projects, decorations, purchases, and some works in progress. It was time for me to update some of the projects. First, I do a repaint on some of the pumpkins. I have a set of three, stacked three pumpkins. I think they're made out of resin. And for some reason, I have one large pumpkin. It's missing two of the little ones. I'm trying to remove some of the little glue and I use a little chisel tool, but then I end up going to pliers and I can get most of the glue off. Next, I spray the outside of the pumpkin with a primer and then I paint it an acrylic oyster white color. So I change it from orange to white. And then I add a sparkly, little hat looks like a little witch's hat and I just put it on top and it fits just great next I moved to a collection of pumpkins I had them on a little cork base but I just am not happy with it and I have some of this paper it's like a packing paper it looks like quilling paper too so I remove some of the pumpkins and then I start to glue around the base and add some of the paper that looks kind of like straw and then I trim off the edges and I add the other pumpkins back to the display. Then I add some green leaves to some of the pumpkins, orange flowers on top of another one, curled green floral wrapped wire for the vines. I redo the two puking pumpkins. One is orange and one is white. I just redo their faces and then I update the actual, the, the puke part with using a pumpkin orange glass paint and then I use little sand bits for the seeds and then I add a little crow figure on top one of the other pumpkins. Part of the collection includes buttons and confetti, little paper owls, and then little holiday jewelry. Then I have some craft store charms. I share a video showing the larger pumpkins that I added to a regular necklace which inspired me to make a mini version. Another idea for many Halloween pieces can be found in party store favors. I added googly eyes to the little bag and candy inside the larger pumpkin, along with some greenery, some stems, and some orange flower petals. I used some seed beads and no hole beads, micro beads, for my Captain Jack Sparrow pumpkin and my little mini necklace. I used some confetti pieces of pumpkins and ghost with string and little seed beads to make a little string light. Some of the pumpkins are made out of clay, resin, and wood. Others are made from plastic or foam. And then I have another video showing a foam pumpkin and a puppy figurine. I have left some of the foam pumpkins plain and then one of them I added googly eyes all the way around and then put some jump rings around one of the little sets of eyes for glasses, and then the little pumpkin with the puppy, and then the pirate one that I added a hat to with the next one. It's a curly-haired looking one made from the green vines, and then a little cat one that I added ears, orange ears, and little white whiskers. And I made some small pumpkins for my little houses Using foam balls, I painted orange and added some green flocking to the top. My mom used to make me miniatures every year for Christmas, and this little house is 28 years old. And you could use the small foam balls or other foam balls and beads for the other scales to make pumpkins. I tried to make a small version of the little pumpkin straw patch so I could put it into the little house my mom made me. It has a little crow in it too. And then I set up a mini treats and sweets display table with tiny fall leaf cookies made by Julie Walter. I also added cheese balls, cake, muffins, and taper candles that I've made in previous videos, plus some macaroons, pumpkin pie, plates, cups, and forks by Christenbon, and a cute little pumpkin teapot that I purchased. And I added a wheelbarrow with squirrels, cat, pumpkin, and leaves to my pumpkin time miniature Halloween collection. I hope you like 
this show and share video. Thank you so much for watching.